Hi Pisces, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Pisces, let's see what's the message here for you today. And a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Pisces spirit, message for my Pisces gang. Pisces, fool in reverse, okay, queen of cups upright, king of swords in reverse, Seven of Wands, Seven of Pentacles in Reverse, Four of Pentacles, High Priestess, Ten of Pentacles and the Judgment Card. Alright, so somebody feels that uh, they've lost out on their love, right? But they have a lot of love in their heart. It's like they feel like such a fool because they look at that person and saying, Hey, I love them so much. I have unconditional love. They're very angry. They're very upset that they pushed this love away, I think, because they feel when I had the time, I should have invested. They probably held back at that point. Now they want to reveal to their person that I'm ready for commitment. I want everything. But now they feel I've been judged. I may not get a second chance now. Maybe the love is lost. So at least that's my first thought, Pisces. I'm going to clarify all these cards for you. But uh, first, let's of course start with some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be. And then I'll clarify these. Pisces and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Pisces and their person. Pisces and that person spirit. All right, let's take a few more Pisces from another deck. Pisces and that person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? All right, just a few more Pisces from a third deck as well, and then we'll start the reading. Pisces and that person. All right, good to go, Pisces. Let's start the reading. And uh, if any of you are looking for personal reading spices, my email is um, omkaratarot at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. So the first card here says, I can't believe how much time we wasted on bullshit. I can tell when you're speaking from your ego or higher self. Although I love your soul, I must admit, I don't like your ego. Maybe somebody was very egoistic, very controlling in the past and they realize that now. I think they're realizing what they've done. Your coded, cryptic messages and, uh, and failure to answer questions drives me up the wall. If you're worried the karmics are going to see, just call me and tell me the effing truth. It's the least I deserve. I admire you, I care about you, I trust you, I respect you and I love you unconditionally. You are my true love. I believe we are meant to be together. I only want two things in life, everything that makes you happy and nothing that makes you suffer. I love you always and forever. My feelings for you are extremely intense. Do you feel the same as I do for you? I'm planning a surprise engagement. I want to ask you to marry me. Isn't that exactly what I said? Somebody wants to, well, pop the question, but they're worried. Will you say yes? I love you not only for your beauty, but also for your soul. Our love will be alive forever because of the way you are. Pure, true, authentic, real, raw and passionate. When I close my eyes, I see your beautiful face and beautiful smile. If I contact you today, will you reject me and my offer? See? Didn't I just say that when I looked at the cards? Somebody is so worried that, you know, they won't get a second chance now. So, the card says that. If I contact you today, will you reject me and my offer? Our union will happen in divine time. We have to trust that. I keep seeing your name everywhere. 
the divine is showing me signs which only lead to you all right so these were some of your messages pisces if these were resonating with your storyline let's start the reading but first of course an angel blessing card for you let's see what my angels will bless my pisces gang with today a blessing guidance advice or a message commitment pisces somebody wants commitment here they're ready for commitment. I think they're not sure whether they will get it. But I do sense that uh, it's only come about because I think the other person has started to love themselves or is uh, now committed to making themselves happy. And that's bringing about a change in this person. I, I mean, I do have a queen of cups here who's not in the or in reverse or, you know, they are they are there loving themselves and, you know, their heart is still open. So that is what is, I think, attracting the other person to now say, oh, my God, I, I, also, I want to I want commitment with them. OK, so now let's start the reading. So tell me, spirit, why is the fool card in reverse? Why is the fool card in reverse? Is somebody feeling like a fool? <laughs> Pisces, the fool card in reverse is clarified by the fool card in reverse. They feel like a big fool, not a small one. <laughs> okay, tell me, give me one more. That's enough of uh, jokes. Give me one more. It's a serious matter. Yeah, they feel like a fool because they ended things. They, they, they feel things have ended because they, maybe they were holding back. Maybe this person was not ready for commitment in the past. Right? They were not ready for commitment. Now they're feeling very, very depressed because now they want it and because they've realized, I love this person. This is the love of my life. Queen of Cups. What's the Queen of Cups? Yeah, they are, they are now confused. They are now confused as to how do they present themselves. Do, should I come forward with passion? Should I come with an apology? What if the apology doesn't get, get accepted? Maybe I should just be flirty and fun with them. What should I do? What should I do? How should I approach them? Somewhere they, feel, they, they don't know whether their apology will be accepted, but they have so much passion, so much passion for this Queen of Cups that it's making them a little upset and angry. Yeah, they are now realizing that uh, all that bad behavior that they showed to their person was a lie. They were lying to themselves. And now they seem to be very angry with themselves. Right? If this person has come to some kind of clarity about their own past behavior. This is the way I was, which is so silly. Why didn't I see the truth back then? Um, seven of Wands. What's the Seven of Wands? They've realized now, they've realized that this is my two of cups, which I pushed away. This is the person who was sent to me by the angels. And what did I do? I took a stick and I shoot them away. I pushed this person away. I pushed away the love of my life. No wonder the fool card came out twice in reverse. I mean, that's a... They feel I had an opportunity. I had an opportunity, many opportunities, and I wasted them. I wasted time, energy, effort. I could have ended the fights then. And now they, have, they feel that the other person uh, has now taken back their power or is now stronger or um, maybe they'll ask questions or something. Uh, four of uh, pentacles. Yeah, they're feeling very imbalanced, very, very, very stressed out because I think they sense that the other person is now holding back from them or uh, is not wanting to engage with them or um, will hold back from them. Uh, tell me more. Yeah, but that doesn't, that doesn't stop this person. They feel, why did I hold back from a person who now I see as my future spouse? They want this person, they want them in their life like forever and ever and ever after and they feel by holding back and not making the choice on time, they are in the danger of now losing out on a ten of cups. They feel that the other person has given up on them, is exhausted of them, is tired of them, has given up on them and that is making them feel, this person feel very weak. Now, now to find that courage. Because now not only do they have to speak their truth, but they also have to unbreak that person's heart. Right? So now there's a lot of stress, a lot of anxiety, a lot of safe, sleepless nights, uh, worries. Why? Because they have to now go and reveal something. 
high priestess in reverse what's the high priestess in reverse yep they want to come if they want to come back it's like if i want to come back i will have to speak out a lot of truths now i will have to be very honest about all the stuff that happened why did i push them away why did i wasn't i ready then why did i do what i did like so ten, ten of pentacles oh they are so scared they are so scared i mean this person is frozen <laughs> frozen with fear Knight of Pentacles, somebody who's like on a horse but not moving. It's like, oops, what do I do now? This is fear attached to it. Like now they've realized that I do want this. I do want to move towards my person. I want to take action. I'm ready to, to start from scratch. As long as they don't leave me behind, don't leave me out. Uh, I don't I want to get out of this feeling of, uh, you know, being by myself. Uh, I want my happiness back. But now the issue here is they feel uh, 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 I've been judged now I may not get a second chance why do you feel this way tell me judgment in reverse judgment in reverse because they breadcrumb their person in the past they could have been giving to more than one or they were distributing their goodies here and there and they didn't offer a you know balanced you know connection to their person in the past this person was stingy with their energy they held back they, they were not ready for a partnership and now they are worried and very depressed that the connection has ended death okay so then why is the ace of cups in reverse oh they feel the other person doesn't love them anymore right under that i had a queen of swords in reverse a queen of swords in reverse is somebody who's Oh, I mean, they can cut your head off. I mean, I think this person is scared. Even though the other person is showing up as a queen of cups, they are scared that I've been cut off. I'm sure, you know, they don't love me anymore. But this entire process has actually awakened this person who's now ready to step up, actually. They have become older and wiser and they want to take responsibility. This person is ready for commitment. They are absolutely ready for commitment. I think that, that this is like nerves. Like how do I go now and express myself? Uh, yeah, they're very, very overwhelmed, very, very burdened. They don't know what the other person is going to decide. What, what will they choose? Maybe in the past this person was a liar or a ghoster or a cheater and all those things will come up. What if my person just shuts the door on me? But uh, even though they're worried about all that, uh, Pisces, let me make it very clear to you. This other person who's now showing up as an emperor, they are ready. They are ready for commitment. They are ready to take responsibility. They are not happy without the other person not being in their life. And they have seen things from all different perspectives. They know why, what they did, why it all ended. They have been through the dark night of the soul. But it's just that they are a little bit stressed. Like this anxiety, stress, sleepless nights. Is how do I now unbreak the heart I've broken? They just looking for a little bit courage okay so that's what i have for you pisces till next time then love and light take care namaste